Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell, former Education Minister Ruel Reed and Caribbean Maritime University President Fritz Pinnock have filed an application in the Supreme Court seeking leave to go to the Judicial Review Court to quash the criminal charges brought against them. On October 9, Reed, his wife Sharon, their daughter Sherelle, as well as Pinnock and Brownstone Division Councillor Kim Brown Lawrence were arrested and charged with corruption and fraud offenses. A $200,000 reward is being offered through Crime Stop for information on the whereabouts of P.J. Matthews, a lecturer at the College of Agriculture, Science and Education in Portland. 63-year-old Matthews, who is from Pasley Gardens, Portland and Kerala, India, has been missing since October 4. Former Prime Minister P.J. Patterson is now recuperating at home after spending a week in hospital. Mr. Patterson was admitted last week with injuries to his knee and hip following a car accident at his Norbrook home. In Canada, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau has won his second term following Monday's national elections. However, he has fallen short of a majority, meaning the Liberals will have to rely on an opposition party to pass legislation. In sports, Jamaican Olympian Elaine Thompson is awaiting a medical review from her doctors to determine her training program for the next season. Thompson had to withdraw from the 200-meter event at the World Championships because of an injury. In year of currency trading today, one U.S. dollar was being sold for $138.89. The British pound sterling for $177.33 and the Canadian dollar for $105.64. In your weather forecast, Wednesday morning will be partly cloudy across sections of eastern parishes. In the afternoon, there will be widely scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms across sections of southern and northwestern parishes. And that's it for the Green Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.